Shalom brothers and sisters. Sure, lots of news today and, and I'll get it out. But this one particularly hits right at home because for years now, we've been discussing and talking about options and possibilities in this building up war between nations and what we knew was coming due to reading our Bibles and knowing prophecy. And one of the things I kept saying now for a good two years and my focus has largely been on Yellowstone. I've always been watching Yellowstone. And I do really think Yellowstone is going to play a large part in the downfall of America as a country. When it goes off, I think it's going to go off. It's a fact. It's overdue. So I've said many times over the last few years, a clever attacker would pop a missile or a suitcase nuke into Yellowstone and let nature take its course. You just need to trigger the sequence of events that will result from that and i've left it at that that's that's where my brain would be if i was the evil dictator attacking the world or whatever country aggressor coming against you why expend troops and everything when you can just pop a missile into a naturally occurring death weapon that'll wipe out 80 percent of the united states with the absolute fallout and clouds and you name it um and now today Russian state TV discusses nuclear strike on Yellowstone volcano. During a recent broadcast on Russian state-run TV, a pundit discussed the possibility of Russia using a nuclear Sarmat missile to strike a volcano in Yellowstone National Park. Anton Gerashenko, an advisor to Ukraine's Minister of Internal Affairs, posted two videos on Twitter of talking heads hosting Vladimir Zolayov, Russia's number one program, discussing the Sarmat. Konstantin Sivkov, a retired Russian naval officer who frequently speaks on military matters on Kremlin-operated outlets, spoke about the special weapon. Sirkov said the powerful Sarmat missile can deliver a large number of nuclear warheads to the target and has the capability of striking across the South Pole. Sarkov then added, the U.S. is particularly vulnerable to such a weapon, which poses a threat to Yellowstone Volcano. So they are focusing on that as a major option for them to quickly pacify anyone that's left after an eruption like that. So interesting and scary, but quite shocking for me this morning to actually see that they're vocalizing what I've been thinking for years is a very real possibility to speed Yellowstone along if that needed to happen. Again, no reason for fear, no reason for stress. We are not destined for wrath. We go with Christ shortly. And I think our timeline is so out of runway. It's not even funny. This airplane is hop hopping to get into the air. But yeah, very interesting. Russia considering Yellowstone a viable target. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.